Alright, welcome back to another Friday Night Fight Night. Tonight's game, groundskeeping, because, I don't know, I gotta clean up or some shit. I'm not really sure how in-depth this is gonna be. We'll just go through all the difficulties and then call it. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> maybe, maybe we'll play this each, each difficulty twice, maybe. Maybe, yeah. Uh... Then we'll call it. <laughs> we'll do easy, medium, hard, and then hard, medium, easy. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> and then maybe we'll do one co-op. Ooh. <laughs> Dude, that's off-brand. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I top? I'm definitely top. Oh, you like being on top. Yeah, that's kind of why I said it. I don't know. This is the one where they made the vacuum slightly better. Yeah. Oh, okay. God. One vacuum is just, like, fucking useless. <laughs> Here we go. Right, right. Okay. Okay. I'm where's, feeling... Where's this fucking trash right now? I don't know. I found something by me. Like a lot. But it's all garbage that swoops around, which is not good. <laughs> Throw up is better. Throw up doesn't move on me. I've done it, Derek. I think we almost ran out of time. Yeah. It's because there's no vomit. It's all trash. And the trash is really bad. That's not what I want to click. Uh, it's because the trash is impossible to pick up because the fucking dust tornado just fucking boosts <laughs> things out of everywhere. Literally nothing is edible. This is a real lot. Dark place. The lore. <laughs> uh. Yeah, this game is... I can see why you always hated this minigame. Yeah, the it's the worst one. It's yeah. fine if there's a lot of vomit, because you can clean up vomit pretty quickly, because it doesn't move. Yeah. But, like, the actual trash fucking shit just doesn't stop. I love that it's like, use the washed, because it's like, don't wash up vomit, because it's hard to pick up. Yeah. And it's just like, it's literally easier than dealing with the vomit. Yeah, exactly. Damn you. Damn you. Damn you. Wait, is the harder difficulty than just give us more vomit? Please? Less time. <laughs> this is like There's less way time. more vomit now. Okay. Dude, this is fucking bullshit. <laughs> Who did it? Did you do it? You did it. Oh, I did it. We ran out of, out of time. time. <laughs> so, who did the thing? Did you do the thing? <laughs> oh, there's accuracy. I feel like just holding the pow the sucking button is w just better. Yes. I uh, yes. Just yes. <laughs> See, the real trick is that you gotta look at it. And then when it's being sucked up, you have to keep your crosshairs over it. Like you're trying to, like, murder in Call of Duty. <laughs> That's the only way. Yeah. You know, you just, you gotta follow your target. If the trash moves, you gotta move with the trash. <laughs> but I'm trash. Then it should be easier for you. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> You'll get a kick out of this. Every time I take the trash out, mm -hmm. I'm like, you got any more trash? Steph, maybe we'll just do one of these. Yeah, they... I'm just like, no, you're you're not supposed to... Okay, fuck it. You can be trash if you want to be trash. It's... No, you don't understand. As the relationship partner, I'm supposed to encourage you, even if I agree. Uh... <laughs> and this is why Chris doesn't maintain relationships. 
has a few reasons. That is definitely not helping though. <laughs> so one of the, uh, there was a YouTuber who I've watched every now and again, but he made a joke about straight white males, right? He's just like, he's like, that's right, I'm the most scary thing on the planet. A straight white male that did like an evil laugh. And he just reposted it to Twitter, but he cuts the video and just... Um, he cuts the video and then just scribbles out straight because now he's gay. <laughs> that man understands humor. I don't like that's good. <laughs> that man understands humor. Some guy wrote a, uh... Some guy wrote a response to him that was just, like, something about, like, trying to hit on him. And he just wrote back, hey man, I said I was gay, not fucking desperate. <laughs> <laughs> like nice, ah, oh, dude. Just, just swear off. Men. Just swear off women. Just go and we go for men. Just swear off men. I just swear off humans. Just entirely. <laughs> yeah, that's true. There's crazy. a lot less drama then. <laughs> Start dating robots. <laughs> dude, robots are the way to go, man. That's the future. Oh, uh, in the words of several see, of my friends is... over many years, Chris, wait for robots. <laughs> Sometimes our friends just get me. <laughs> there are, um... There's an entire, like, thing in Japan of, like, guys... Dang. <laughs> about, uh, people who are getting attracted to mo robots and, like, that type of stuff more than actual people. And I'm like, oh, I should just move it over there. You know, he'll fit right in. There's just... The robots just aren't where we need them to be, man. That's yeah, just how I it agree. Is. Fuck it, like, once they're where we need them to be, then we'll be talking, but... Dude, I am literally shooting my vacuum at just hordes of trash, and, and nothing is getting taken up. up. Yeah. Welcome to my life, Chris. Not in anything. This is my life. Alright, um... Yeah, they're just, they're just not where they need to be. There was... Did I show you the one about the maids they have? There, the robot maids? There was this, like, this guy who's been making these, like, robot maids. They're, like, little anime-looking robot maids. Uh -huh. And, uh, they're, they're on, like, wheels and stuff, but they wear, like, Oh, I've seen these. I've thing. seen I these. I might have sent it to you, but, like, there's only two of them or something. And, uh, YouTube randomly recommended it to me one day. Like it I, like, does. And I saw it, and I was just, like, I was watching the video, and all I could think to myself was... It's kind of cute in a, like, destroy all humans kind of way. Like, he's kind of, like, they're kind of adorable, but also, like, really uncanny and make me really concerned for the human race. Oh, dude, I don't... <laughs> I, I, you've probably heard about this. Something Basilisks, I think it's called. It's called. Yeah. And it's, like, an AI... It's supposed to be, like, a self-aware AI <coughs> that is going to become so self-aware that, like, it's going to destroy the people and make the life a living hell for people who didn't try to, uh... Mm. Uh, create it. Yeah. Like, put everything into their life to get this thing into existence. Yeah, which... Like, that would ever happen. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... And I guess if you know about it, it's supposed to be like, then you're about to die and shit. Yeah. So, oh, thanks, uh, Derek. You're welcome, yeah, internet. Thanks, Derek. <laughs> <laughs> um... Yeah, it, it's funny, they, um... It's funny creepypastas on the internet. <laughs> Yeah, that's a way to put it. <laughs> Dude, we, as a society, Are sure need help. <laughs> just in general. Nothing specific. <laughs> Dude, I just... It's so annoying because I'm like, how am I doing compared to Chris? I look at you and I'm like, how did he... Okay. I'm good at video games. You have a practice with this? <laughs> yeah, that's probably it. When was the last... When did we beat this game again? Uh, I meant overall in your lifetime, Chris. <laughs> Dude, what is going on with my fucking beam? It doesn't work, I swear to God. It, it's actually horrible. Oh, it's been great. Um, can I just... I'm literally standing on top of these two piles of trash, and I can't pick them up. I'm, okay. done. I'm done. This is dumb. <laughs> uh, Dude, one more... Final round. Final round? Final All round. The hardest difficulty. I uh, we'll call it. Mainly because this isn't even ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> How much more time do we need? Oh yeah, one minute. All the marbles. Yeah, well, it's just... You'll, you'll all definitely the win. But, difficulty. but you'll win. Oh. Dude, I was looking at a uh, belt again. Mm -hmm. It's like championship belts. You know what? We could get a cheap one. 
We, we champion could, belt? We, we, yeah, we could get like a really cheap WWE. Well, not WWE, but we could get like a really cheap championship belt for the show. Just just championship belt. It doesn't have I mean, to say they're, not, they're still more expensive than I'd ever be willing to pay, but like I could get like a crappy one shipped to us for only like 200 bucks. <laughs> it's alright, we could do that. And we'll just, whoever wins the... <laughs> That episode of Friday Night Fight Night will take it home for the week. Yeah, that's that's literally how it works. <laughs> yeah, I can see this working. Well, you take it home for show, though. Ah, uh, yes. Right, like, I, you, we give you the belt, and we'd be like, you're the champion, you get to take it home, but it stays at my house, because you don't show up every week to record. That's true. So <laughs> That's true. Sometimes life has a prior commitment. <laughs> And, and I might need that belt for giving it to someone else, and then I'll just tell them that you relinquished the belt. Don't worry about it, it's fine. Uh... <laughs> Because he couldn't defend it that week. <laughs> you know, fucking sucks! Dude, what are you talking about? It's great. I'm doing so well. I'm doing just as well as you, honestly. I was doing well, and then you had more throw-up than I had. Then go find the throw-up. It's not worth my time. It sounds like a true loser. Well, I won, so <laughs> fuck you! Derek wins one out of nine. I win! <laughs> Woo! You've seen the meme of the second place guy fucking showboating. Third self. place guy. Third place. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, with that, we're going to pick it up in the next Friday Night Fight. I'm going to see you guys then. Peace. Peace.